tonight on my big show, Anne Marie Brave Centre Wall. An unmissable midnight game show with Alison Hammond. Amazing new music from James Blunt. And Ricky Wilson becomes our latest unexpected star star of the show. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the big show. Please welcome your host, Michael McIntyre. show for you this evening where we will of course have big Stop. big Stop. and even bigger Stop. but first who would like to play send to all <laughs> this week's guest is one of the UK's best undoubtedly singer-songwriters. She has three top ten albums and has been streamed over, here we go, seven billion times. <laughs> it is Anne-Marie! Oh, just love her. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. So, who are you here with? This is my mum and dad, and this is my sister, Sam. Oh, Hi. welcome. <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling about the prospect of handing over your phone to me? Um, I, I was excited, and now I need a poo. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Like, I'm actually shaking. <laughs> oh, my God, you are? Yeah, I'm <laughs> you are. No, you mustn't be that nervous. Is the nerve, do this stem from being away from your phone or just what might happen or where? where let's get to the bottom of the fear. Um, I'm worried what you're going to say mm -hmm. and I'm worried that no one will reply. Because <laughs> 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 they're here. Because they're here. <laughs> so are you quite family orientated? Yeah, I have a small group. I mean, I That's have a so lot funny. of conta contacts yes. so you can message. So your inner circle... Yeah. Dare I say, your entire circle <laughs> is, is currently in the box. Yeah. <laughs> so that could be awkward. OK, well, I don't want you to be this nervous. Yeah, I know. Just I relax, need to chill cos out. it's always fun. There's nothing bad that's ever come. Take a deep breath. Well, not only are you amongst friends, you're amongst your only friends. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you have them. Um, now, words mean a lot to you, mm. Marie, because you actually have, you know, inspirational sayings and things as tattoos. Yes. So yeah. every, every one of my tattoos is written by somebody who has taught me that thing in life. Wow. Or That's like cool. a, something that I want to be reminded of. So ah. my sister wrote love, and ah. my mum wrote family is everything, and my dad wrote don't get a tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> 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 A tattoo of yeah. don't get a tattoo. Yeah. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> All right, well, let's do it. Yeah. Um, oh, thank God. you so, so much for Ooh. coming. Thank you for doing this. So, what we have here is our cushion. Yeah. All you need to do is pop the phone in there. It slots. In the crack. Yes. <laughs> so, let's do this. Let's play Centre Wall. Here we go. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, of Anne Marie's. It's a big. You gone for the big one? Heavy. Yeah, it's the new one. Yeah, I'm going on the telly. Let's get the new one, is it? <laughs> well, when I plug that in, that should pop up. There it is. <laughs> that is Anne Marie's phone. <laughs> and who's this person? 
This is Sam's son, my nephew, Preston. Oh, Sam's son? Sam's son! Sam's son. I <laughs> Okay. I thought, My name is Sam. I thought you were worried about the degree of advertising Apple were getting. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, in the interest of impartiality, that's Samsung. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh. little baby Samsung. What a sweet guy. Okay, well, let's have a quick look. There's a lot going on here. The photos, let's have a look at those. Oh, oh yes. Oh, what have we got here? Oh, yeah. Um, so this, <laughs> the woman on the front is Shania Twain. Shania Twain? Yeah. So and I is that you? <laughs> yeah, I'm on the back. <laughs> because there were two horses available, and I said I'd feel much more safer getting on the back of you, Shania. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I... <laughs> so this is when we... That's lovely. Yeah, we recorded a music video, and that's in is Nashville, that was, yeah. Very, very cool. She is so cool. Did you, did you like, um, gallop with her, with Shania? She was like, we're just going to speed up a little bit, and I was just like, grab. I didn't know if... I was like, can, can I grab? I know, it's, you can't just grab and Shania like, Twain. You need permission to grab. <laughs> you don't want to just grab, and she's like, that don't impress me. <laughs> Um, <laughs> cheese? Cheese? Yes, cheese. <laughs> oh. So, basically, I went vegan yeah. about five years ago. Right. But I loved cheese before. OK. And I dipped. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had a bad night. <laughs> and I, I ate all the cheese. <laughs> yeah. You fell off the cheese wagon. Yeah. <laughs> Well, look, you know, come on. Well done for being a vegan. It's difficult. Yeah. You've had a relapse. It's yes. fine. No one's going to blame you for that. Yeah. You I know? Didn't, I've not gone back. No, it was one, but was it No, I've not amazing? gone back to being vegan. Oh. <laughs> uh, OK, I see. Um, all right, well, that was a relapse. Um, <laughs> No! <laughs> but the, oh! Oh, God. Oh, no. This is... This is too... Oh! <laughs> yep. Is that you? Yep. Whoa. I don't know how old I was. I don't know. 55? <laughs> <laughs> you remind me of something, like, from Dallas or something, like 1981. <laughs> I thought I looked so good. That is so fun. OK, well, I think it's time <laughs> to... Oh, my God. I'm on the toilet there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Why did you take a photo um, on the toilet? Me and my friend Chelsea, we always... Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> we always send each other photos <laughs> of us on the toilet. <laughs> OK, well... <laughs> <laughs> Why is. have you been on this one for so long? <laughs> anyway, that is now in the public domain. <laughs> um, so, look, let's write this text. Now, I need to talk to you about this. OK. OK. I feel sick now. <laughs> if you need the loo, I can give you a phone back. <laughs> <laughs> OK, now, we've taken a shot in the dark here, and let's see what happens. But because you have so many inspirational things written on your body, um, for the first time ever on Centre All, we're going to do a couple of things. I'm going to tell everyone on your phone that this is Centre All, mm -hmm. and I'm going to ask them <laughs> to come up with an idea for a tattoo. No. <laughs> And we actually have your tattoo artist. <laughs> standing by in a tattoo parlour a few <laughs> moments away from the theatre. <laughs> so what we're asking, and of course, it's only going to happen if you're 100% fine, because of course, no one's going to hold you down. <laughs> so I'm going to ask everyone on your phone 
what mm. they would say, and we're looking for something funny, inspirational, poignant, whatever you decide. Okay. And if yeah. you're up for it, we will take you there tonight. <laughs> tonight? Tonight. <laughs> so, would you agree to at least enter into this process and see how it goes? Yeah. Well, what about that, ladies yeah. and gentlemen? <laughs> All right, so let's pop this text in. So I'm going to be completely honest. Hi, it's Michael McIntyre. You see? Never done that before. No. Sent to all first. I have Anne Marie's phone. See? Nice. We are playing <laughs> Sent to all. See? She's agreed to get a <laughs> tattoo live on my show. <laughs> I need you to suggest what it should be. It can either be words oh. or a picture. No, a pi you know what all my friends are going to say. What? A willy. <laughs> if every single one of them <laughs> says willy, <laughs> then you'll have no choice in the matter. <laughs> I'm going to say that now. Or a picture. <laughs> and then we'll just end with this. And this is where you guys come into it. The one that gets the biggest laugh... No! <laughs> ..will get tattooed on Anne-Marie tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Suggestions Anne Marie's contacts have, but until then, one more time for the amazing Anne Marie and her lovely family. <laughs> well done, amazing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the unexpected star star of the show. <laughs> As you know, we have the unexpected star, and we've been doing that for many, many series. But what we're doing this series, to mix it up a little bit, is we are actually getting actual stars who are well-known, famous singers to come to the theatre under false pretenses. <laughs> and they will arrive, and they will sing for us, or they won't, we don't know what's going to happen, <laughs> immediately, as soon as they arrive on this stage. <laughs> Their song will start playing, the microphone will be there, you'll all be going crazy, and the question is, will they or won't they sing? <laughs> so, this is Ricky Wilson. <laughs> he is 45 years old, and he's from Keefley in West Yorkshire, and from an early age, he dreamed of being a singer, and he fulfilled that dream when he became the lead singer of the Kaiser Chiefs, selling over eight million records. And tonight, he is going to be performing on this very stage, and he has no idea about that. <laughs> so, aside from being the lead singer of the Kaiser Chiefs, he is a DJ for Virgin Radio. Bosses have told Ricky that he will be doing some filming tonight for the station's social media at one of London's hippest new venues, a pop-up soft play centre for adults, <laughs> which includes a giant indoor slide. And at the bottom is a ball pond on this very stage. <laughs> and the rest of the Kaiser Chiefs will be waiting for him. <laughs> then they're going to strike out... And they're going to go round and round the opening until he gets his bearings, wander round, <laughs> we'll all be pointing at the microphone, and with a bit of luck, he will then walk forward and go, Oh, what did the people get Larry? It's not very pretty, I tell thee. And we'll all be on our feet going, I predict a road! <laughs> so, he's actually doing his Virgin Radio show right now. We're going to go live to the studio. 
You're unbelievable. Bam Ricky Wilson, it is drive time. There's not a lot of songs that, well, there's a lot of songs I like, but there's not a lot of songs I'm jealous of, and that is one of them. EMF. Unbelievable. I'm going to actually pretend to be a caller, and I'm going to phone in, and I'm going to do a competition <laughs> from this stage. Try and be quiet, OK? Otherwise, he'll think something's up. We've got something brand new today. One lucky caller has a chance to win £1,000. And also, you can get tickets to my tour. That's worth, that's worth millions. <laughs> Crikey. On the line now, we have Richard Dickinson from Bristol. Hello, Richard. All right, there? All right? Can you hear me? How are you doing? Yeah, doing all right. I'm quite nervous. Uh, don't worry about being I nervous. Be OK, the rules are simple. It's a question all about me. Now, are you very familiar right. with me as a person? Yeah, no, huge fan of the handkerchiefs. Uh, <laughs> £1,000 for the correct answer, and you win tickets to my tour, so that's the booby prize. Can't okay. wait. That's brilliant. Love to see you live. Uh, in 2004, what did Kaiser Chiefs predict? OK, so Ooh, 2004, Kaiser Chiefs predicted something. Predict? What did they predict? I predicted something. What did I predict? Was it a downturn uh, of the pound against the no, dollar? No, 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 no. Well, <laughs> is that going to be your final answer? Because... Um, was it some weather? Was it weather? Was it that? Uh, was it that? It wasn't. Iceland it wasn't. The, it wasn't the Icelandic ash cloud. Oh God! <laughs> that was a bit oh, later. You, you did predictions. Was it lottery winner? No, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. If you don't know, <sighs> I tell you what. If if you get it now, I'll give you the grand out of my pocket. A riot! Yes, yeah. <laughs> oh. All right. Thank you, Google. Oh no, sorry. Should uh, I said that? Well, I'm gonna. Anyway, I'm gonna have to pay for that now. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you so much. <laughs> and you've got tickets Can't wait to, to come see you next to year. You're in the Kaisers. Love you. Thank you very much, uh, Dick Dickinson. <laughs> Love to speak to you and have a good evening. Uh, we are. Thanks, uh, Ricky. Lots of love, mate. Bye. See you later. Ricky Wilson on Virgin Radio. Well, that was Ricky, and he is going to be finishing that show in 15 minutes. And then he's going to be going, he's going to have a little drink with his manager around the corner. And when we say we're ready, we're going to have an absolutely incredible surprise. You up for that, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> it is now time to play the Midnight Game Show! <laughs> this is, of course... The only game where if you snooze... Yeah. Correct! This Midnight Game Show is as fun and funny as we've ever had. We are used to seeing her in the mornings, and we're about to see what happens to her when I wake her up in the dead of night. It's Hamo, Alison Hammond! <laughs> Go on, Hamo! <laughs> It's so good to Come see you, Come on, darling. darling. I have... Oh. Is it right, everyone? Yes, Hamo! I feel like I'm in my bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're about to see inside oh, your bedroom. Oh, God, I'm so nervous. So you live in Solihull, yeah. and you live there with your lovely son, Aidan. Yes. Who you can't believe set you up for I, ca I can't believe I didn't find out about <laughs> yeah. it more than anything else. Yeah. He's only 18, yet he organised the whole thing. Yeah. I can't believe it. So you fell asleep. You were wearing a, would you, what would you call this, like a nightshirt? It's a bonnet. It's a, a silk bon bonnet. A, a look silk, after my hair. A silk bonnet. If I'd known, I would have worn these pyjamas. Yeah. No, well, you were wearing a... I was wearing, like, a, a friend's T-shirt. It was a friend's T-shirt. <laughs> no bra. I think... <laughs> no, no bra. There's a bra in bed, no one. Guilty. So, <laughs> <laughs> so Alison, I've woken up many people on the Midnight Game Show. Yes. And sleeping positions-wise, people tend to be uh, side. It tends to be side, yeah. sometimes leg over the duvet. <laughs> um, you were sleeping <laughs> face down oh, in yeah. the bed. I'm a face down. <laughs> yeah, I just put my head to the side like it's comfortable. No, no, there was no to the side. You were face <laughs> down. Yeah, it's like you had landed <laughs> from a... No, you, it was like... <laughs> It's like you'd fallen from the sky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I wasn't. <laughs> I, was, I was tired. <laughs> I was tired. You man. were tired, but we woke you up, <laughs> yeah. and you and you woke up pretty quickly. I was like, "What's going on here?" And then yes, 
It's a weird You moment. were there? Yeah. But, <laughs> but what was nice is that you were the first female that we've woken up. Oh, well, I'll be honest with you, it was one of the best nights It ever. really was. It was well, so right. good. Well, let's have a look, because it was tremendous fun. It was. Let's enjoy <laughs> Alison Hammond's Midnight oh Game Show! So, we are in Solly Hull and the nation's daytime television sweetheart is sleeping soundly in her home. She burst onto our screens on Big Brother. So what's the time now, Alex? 1.17 a.m. You might recognise that voice. That's Marcus Bentley, the voice of Big Brother. Thanks, Marcus. Alice lives with her son, Aidan who's given us the all clear that she's fast asleep. That's Alison's house on the right. And that's Dermot O'Leary on the left. <laughs> Security light. Exact time, actually. It's 1:30 a.m. <laughs> yes, of course. Marcus. It's, it's Marcus. Marcus <laughs> is here to Hello, tell you the Marcus. time. Marcus, I've loved this show. <laughs> <laughs> Bones, so, I haven't got no makeup on. Don't worry, we've got a glam squad for you. No. 30 seconds. We're going to give you a 30-second glam squad. Your 30 seconds start now. In comes the glam. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Foundation. Oh, you look stunning, babe. 20 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> this is the worst. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, no. Oh, that's it. Glam's falling out. I don't want you to go. That's not bad. <laughs> that is a look of magazine. It's the best I've ever done. <laughs> Hello. Question number one on the Midnight Game Show. Oh, yeah. Name three films starring The Rock. Jumanji. Yes. Um, what else has The Rock been? Yes, been in? that's the question. He's in a lot of action films he's been in. A lot of action films. As much action as your... Uh, plug. <laughs> <laughs> that seemed better day. <laughs> Jumanji. Jumanji. Come on, two Jumanji more. Two. J what? Yeah, Jumanji 2. Yeah, why not? Is there a Jumanji 3? There's quite a few. I can't remember yeah. the name. All right, fine. Well, you, could have, you could have had Tooth Fairy. I interviewed him for that. Oh, goodness. Oh, anyway, no. right, let's move on with your midnight game show. So, now I need to try and identify this person by their laugh. <laughs> it sounds familiar. Is it Rusty Lee? Yeah! Hello! Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Sleeping with factor 50. <laughs> I mean, there's being safe. I mean, <laughs> where's the sun that creeps? It's important to be Don't safe. Creep. <laughs> because it's very serious. A lot of people have been getting burnt. Uh, inside at night. <laughs> OK. All right. So, we've looked into this. We've had scientists look into it. And we have discovered officially that you two have the lowest threshold for comedy on, on, on planet Earth. It, like, if, if I told a joke and failed to get a laugh from you two, I would... I would retire forever. <laughs> which is why we're going to play oh God. a little head to head. Head to head. Try not to laugh challenge. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We have to do be serious. <laughs> we have to do be serious. We haven't actually started. <laughs> <laughs> OK, so we, are, we have got Mar Marcus Bentley from Big Brother this is, amazing. is, Thank go you for coming is Marcus. going to is going to read some jokes. Use everything you've got now. OK, not to laugh. Okay. OK, we let us show people that we've got depth. OK, <laughs> all right. So here comes the first joke. Oh, OK, what did the blanket see when it fell off the bed? To know. Oh, sheet. <laughs> I think Rusty may have got, may have got that by a whisker. That was quite good. OK, one nil to Rusty, and that, that is a surprise. <laughs> How many tickles does it take to make an octopus laugh? Tickles. Um, Ten tickles. Ah! <laughs> one all! Ooh, we're moving to deciders. <laughs> Next one wins. What do you call a moose with no name? An anonymous. <laughs> <laughs> Alison Hammond is the winner! <laughs> Thank you very much, Rusty Lee, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so fun. Rusty. Thank you. Thank you very well much. done, Rusty. Oh, bye. Thanks, bye -bye. Rusty, for coming. <laughs> bye, baby. Bye. 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 Oh, my God, this is amazing. I can't take any more. Now we have uh, another guest, uh, somebody who you admired from your childhood. Oh. Um, it's a mystery guest. This was um, one of your favourite fans. I can tell you the lead singer is in this. So... Oh, my God, if that's who I think it is. Who do you think it is? If that is Kylie Minogue, I'll be <laughs> flipping lose it. That's not Kylie Minogue. She's a Spice Girl. She was in a band. I'm going to give you some things to wear to help you from the 1980s. Here are some clues. Some clues. It's not Madonna, is it? Kind of... <laughs> <laughs> I liked so many people back then. Look, this is very Kylie, very Madonna-y. Is this Five Star? How much do you love Five Star? A lot. Don't mess around. Shut up! <laughs> We're going to play another game. Yes. Um, this is the best ever and life. in order to do that, <laughs> we are actually going to um, pop downstairs. Are we? Yeah. Can so. I put my bra on? Do yes. <laughs> yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> so here is a clip um, that I'm sure everyone remembers. Yes. So this. <laughs> yes. Was <laughs> on this morning. It's an absolute classic. This is muddly. Well, in your garden is uh, three sailors. 
and three paddling pools. All you have to do is recognize the sailor and push him into the paddling pool. <laughs> I think I'll be able to recognise him. Well, let's go and find <laughs> out. Draw on and let's head into the garden. Can somebody help Alison with her bra? <laughs> so, hello. This is your splendid autumnal garden. And here are sailors A, B and C. Now, we need to walk along here and have a good look. That day. He looks really familiar. Right, let's have a look. That's A. He looks very familiar. He looks really familiar. It's definitely not B. Definitely not. Definitely B. not B. But he looks really familiar as well. C. Oh, Do you know what? It's between A. A and C. I think I know who it is. Okay. Who? Well, it's up to you. Don't say it. You just have to push them. Super fun. Let's get you back upstairs. Okay. <laughs> okay. Best day of my life. Can I We're gonna we're gonna set the game up. Do not move a muscle. Gonna set a little thing around you. All right. So before you went into the Big Brother house, yes. I've heard that you were going to appear on another television show that you never got to appear on. Yeah, Is that well, right? So what was true. that going to be? I was going to be on Blind Dave. Well, if you take the blindfold off and don't move a muscle, we are going to finally give you the opportunity <laughs> to play Blind Dave. Are you actually joking? So, somebody is on the other side of <laughs> that in your bed. Now, to identify who it is, you're going to ask questions, yes. and they are going to give a yes or no answer. Okay. So, do you want to start asking yeah. any question with a yes or no answer? Uh, hello there, uh, Dave. Uh, um, I was just wondering, are you an entertainer? Yeah. Yes, you're an entertainer. Are you a musician? Yeah. So you're a singer? Yeah. Oh my God, there's a singer in my bed! <laughs> <laughs> um, I, have you ever been in I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here? Yes. <gasps> Have you ever been in a show called Neighbours? Jason Donovan so on your I was just walls. obsessed. So when he was like um, getting married to Did Kylie you Minogue, ask me the question uh, in yeah. Neighbours, yeah. I used to pretend and like have dreams that it was actually me who were married. Really? I didn't What's the song again they played on your wedding? What was the uh, song? Suddenly. Alexa, play Suddenly by Angry Anderson. It's starting. <laughs> it's starting. It's your wedding day. Oh, Christ. I am married, but, but you know, while I'm whilst I'm Just here. this moment. <laughs> forget her. Suddenly! Everybody! Jason Donovan, ladies and gentlemen! A dream come true! Thank you may finish. <laughs> <laughs> My levers are sweaty. <laughs> Let's take those levers off. <laughs> Thank you Jason, so much. That was brilliant. Come back. You know where I am. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Good night. I don't think I can go back to sleep now. 
I'm too excited. Oh, that was the best thing that's ever happened to me. <laughs> oh. Jason! Jason! Come back! Come back! Oh, that was so good. So good. So good. Oh, my God. Oh, hello. That was just, like, the most bizarre thing that has ever happened to me in my time. Jason Donovan, I mean, that topped it off. I mean, I don't know why he was wearing so much leather. <laughs> it was bizarre, wasn't it? Was but I, I didn't strong. mind. No. no. I, did, I didn't mind the leather. <laughs> I, I was OK with it. It was an amazingly romantic moment. And yeah. he wasn't that startled. He, he sort of embraced I it. I think he was, all, oh, he, was, he was up for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> in another life. <laughs> it was lovely, though. Honestly, it was so nice. Well, it made us so happy that you kept saying it was the best night of your life. Honestly, it was, I'm not even joking, everyone. If you can have that happen to you, go for it. <laughs> Honestly, it was brilliant. Yeah, their careers need to take off a bit before I go. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have some presents for you. Oh, yeah. Just to top Is off. Is it Jason Donovan? Um, <laughs> I don't have Jason Donovan. Well, yes, I do. Oh, my I, God, what's I that? I have. This is the ah. neighbour's um, wedding. You have been superimposed <laughs> onto Kylie Minogue's face. Oh, I love it. So this is your dream. Oh, like Kylie? And Jason has written something to you. Um, oh, you he's for Alison. Oh, there's too many broken hearts, but I won't give up the fight for you. Oh, that Thank is you, Jason. so emotional. <laughs> Together, though. You actually do. You actually do. Well, it is time for me to present you Aww. with your iconic Midnight Game Show Thank Do you. Not Disturb sign Aww. to ensure this will never happen again. But having said that, you absolutely love it. Do you know it. what? I never so... wanted it to happen to me. Yeah. But now that it's happened, it's Aww. one of the best things ever. Well, so you, you are one of the best things ever. You're Aww. so amazing for So, so fun. Yeah. Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, the sensational, and wonderful, and lovely Thank and you. hilarious Alison Hammond! Next, ladies and gentlemen, we have a real musical treat for you. Singing all the love that I ever needed, it is, of course, James Blunt Blunt! <laughs> James Blunt Blunty! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. So tell us, how are you? What's happening? So this is from your new album? Yes, it's called Who We Used To Be. OK. It's fantastic. It's amazing. Really, really. Um, and then what do you do? You tour. I go this on is, tour. This is the plan, isn't it? Yeah, I, the kick off, I kick off in uh, yeah. late February and, uh, and then I'm on the road. I'm through here in March and April. Come on down. I'm playing in London. Yes. Come on down, guys! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, James Blood Bloody! So, who would like to play Sent to All? <laughs> so let's remind everybody the text I sent into Anne Marie's phone earlier tonight. Hi, it's Michael Magata. I have Anne Marie's phone and we're playing Sent to All. She's agreed to get a tattoo live on my show. I need you to suggest what it should be. It can either be words or a picture. The one that gets the biggest laugh. <laughs> will get tattooed on Anne-Marie tonight! <laughs> so, I'm going to read these out, and if you think any are potentially in the mix, let me know, and then we'll narrow it down. <laughs> OK. So, we'll start with a fun one from you, Dad. And he has offered this suggestion as a tattoo. Don't get another tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who is Claire? Oh, this is funny. Who's... She's my best friend. She says, excellent. I already know what I will write. Claire O'Dwyer taught me everything I know, and you're all very welcome. And then she said, this is brilliant, if you can add my Insta handle, that would be great. <laughs> Unlikely, Claire, but thanks for the suggestion. <laughs> Oh, this is a fun one, I have to say. <laughs> Who's Jazz? My manager. <laughs> She's just put Michael McIntyre forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jazz, very clever. Come on. <laughs> 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 OK, 
granddad Tom. Aww. Aww. Wait, grand my granddad Tom? Granddad Tom. Has <laughs> written back? What, what do you think happened? <laughs> I was so confused. I thought someone had written, have Grandad Tom. No, Grandad Tom has, Tom has replied. Right, right. How old is Grandad Tom? 82. Yeah. Right. But he's not very technical minded. He'd probably send a picture of his head or something. Right? <laughs> it's quite sweet. What do you say? Simply the best. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Liam Murray, who's that? My friend's wife. Your friend's wife yep. has sent a photograph of an aubergine. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait a minute. You're considering the aubergine. <laughs> it's my favourite vegetable. <laughs> so you, you were worried it was going to be a willy? <laughs> You'd rather it was the emoticon symbol. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I didn't expect it, but <laughs> aubergine's in the mix, guys. <laughs> Am I right in saying that aubergine's in the leap? Aubergine is in the mix. Aubergine, um, simply the best, and don't get another tattoo on my favourite so far. Underneath the tattoo you already have that says, don't get a tattoo. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll cross that one out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ray? Oh, yeah, singer. Oh, yes, Ray's amazing. Goodness, this is a big ask. Mm. How about a picture of me? <laughs> or a microphone, because we both love to sing. Or some bread, because we both love bread. <laughs> <laughs> bread is the best. I would get a piece of bread. Bread's in the mix? Yeah. Yvonne's got quite involved. Oh, wow, yeah. Who's that? That's... <laughs> don't even know how to explain who she is. She looks after me when I go to Ibiza. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take her number and move on. <laughs> <laughs> Anne-Marie loves peanut butter. So how about a peanut with a slogan underneath? I am a nutter, like peanut butter. <laughs> LOL. <-O. laughs> I'm a nutter, like peanut butter. That's not in the mix, is it? I might get a peanut butter jar. <laughs> OK, we have a short list. OK, go on. We have Aubergine from Leah Murray. We have Simply the Best from Grandad. Yeah. Everyone loves that one. That's a good one. <laughs> we have Michael McIntyre Forever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not getting much traction. <laughs> and we have Don't Get Another Tattoo from oh, Dad. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> 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 a jar of peanut butter from Yvonne Anderson. Yeah. Yep. And bread. Bread. From Ray. I think you all like Simply the Best. Yeah! It's from your granddad. Yeah. And you Have know you... what's crazy? What? So that's from my dad's dad. Yes. And I don't think he even knows, but it was my mum's dad's favourite song. Oh. And he doesn't even know that. And he's. Oh, and so it feels good. Yeah, it's like. Perfect. And you're okay with this? Yeah. yeah Are you right. asking me or my mum? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was asking you. Me? <laughs> yes. You're 100% yes. okay. Yeah, I will. I might get a piece of bread as well. Oh, the double! <laughs> bread, not aubergine. Go bread, bread over aubergine. You can get the aubergine. Oh. <laughs> well, I know where I'll put it. <laughs> <laughs> you are amazing. So, ladies and gentlemen, she has to be the best sport we've ever had playing Centaur, <laughs> Anne-Marie. <laughs> amazing. <laughs> so, we're going to go. We're going right now. Anne-Marie and I are going to go down the road to the tattoo parlour. Come on, then. <laughs> and I'll give her a phone book. Um, bye, Dad. Bye, Sis. Bye, Mama. All right, let's go. Amory, ladies and gentlemen, this is yours. You can have that back now. Oh, my God. Here we go. This is 
uh, this is for me it's a home from home uh, i know all the guys in here i know all the guys in here okay um you're gonna write it yeah I, i've only just learned that so we're gonna go bread and i'm gonna write simply the yeah. best and where are we putting it where i'm gonna put the simply the best on my leg amazing and bread somewhere on my arm okay well that sounds like a plan yeah let's go Stressful things I've ever had to do in my life. <laughs> oh my god, this is going to be for the rest of your life. Yeah. I'm quite happy with the symphony. This is good. This is good so far. My bottom lip is sweating, but this is good. Yes! It looks really good. Yes! We're gonna do it, okay? Here we go. <laughs> now the bread. <laughs> <laughs> it looks really, really good. Is it cute? Yes, it, it absolutely really is. You've done an amazing job. Thank you. Well, I cannot believe you've done this. So here we have the two tattoos. We have. We have simply, simply the, the best, best and a and slice, slice of, of bread. bread. Thank you very much <laughs> to Anne Marie. Give the audience a wave. What an incredible night. Sensational, <laughs> amazing. Oh my God. What an extraordinary sensible that was. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for the arrival of our unexpected star star of the show, Ricky Wilson from the Kaiser Chiefs. <laughs> so he's on his way to what he thinks is a soft play center for adults. So Ricky will have no idea that he's entering the theatre because he'll be taken round the back of it, which looks like just a normal road with shops and offices. Then he is going to be... Hi. Oh, by the way, it's the Kaiser Chiefs awaiting his arrival. They're all here. They're all in on it. <laughs> OK, so he's going to be crawling all over all sorts of padded rooms. He will then arrive at the top of the slide here and he will shoot onto this stage. You will go completely crazy. The band's going to strike up immediately, and then hopefully he will sing the first line. Do you want to give me the intro, and I'll, we'll see how that works before he arrives? Let's see. I've always wanted to do this. I think we've met earlier tonight, as you said midway through the song. <laughs> so, yeah, oh, you were Dick Dickinson or something. <laughs> um, yes, that, that was me earlier. First off... Yes? Oh, my God, what an insane 
impromptu performance. What? How was it? That amazing. <laughs> I, I enjoyed it immensely. Thank you very much for that. Well, it's, it must have been completely mind-blowing for uh, you to... Um, so talk to me what go, went through your head. Because you were taking it very, very seriously, the soft play. You were really going for it. I just wanted to get over and done with. OK. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I walked in, they said, this is for the radio, because, you know, I do the show. Yes. And then I said, has Chris Evans had to do this? And they went, no. <laughs> has Graham Norton done this? No. And I went, am I the first, then? And I'm like, this... Uh, I, Every time on the first one. <laughs> well, we, we are all thrilled that Chris Evans wasn't singing for us tonight. <laughs> um, we didn't know what was going to happen when, obviously, your band struck up that um, and how you're going to handle that. I mean, it, it was unbelievable. You sung that amazingly. Honestly, I can Thank sing you. that in a hurricane. Well, you certainly blew the roof off this place. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Ricky Wilson and the Kaiser Chiefs! <laughs> Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Good night, bravo! If you'd like to nominate someone for the unexpected star of the show or for any other surprise, go to bbc.co.uk slash bigshow for all the details. Happening. So this is from your new album? Yes, it's called Who We Used To Be. OK. It's fantastic. It's amazing. Really, brilliant. Um, and then what do you do? You tour? I go this on is, tour. This is the plan, isn't it? Yeah, I, the kick off, I kick off in uh, yeah. late February and, uh, and then I'm on the road. I'm through here in March and April. Come on down. I'm playing London. Yes, come on down, guys! <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, James Blood Bloody! <laughs> So, who would like to play Said to All? <laughs> so let's remind everybody the text I sent into Anne Marie's phone earlier tonight. Hi, it's Michael Magadar. I have Anne Marie's phone and we're playing Send to All. She's agreed to get a tattoo live on my show. I need you to suggest what it should be. It can either be words or a picture. The one that gets the biggest laugh. <laughs> will get tattooed on Anne-Marie tonight! <laughs> oh. So, I'm going to read these out, and if you think any... She's just put Michael McIntyre forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jazz, very clever. Come on. No. <laughs> okay, Granddad Tom. Aww. Wait, grand my Granddad Tom. Granddad Tom has <laughs> written back. What? What do you think happened? <laughs> I was so confused. I thought someone had written, have Grandad Tom. No, Grandad Tom has, Tom has replied. Right, right. How old is Grandad Tom? 82. Yeah. Right. But he's not very technical minded. He'd probably send a picture of his head or something. Right? <laughs> it's quite sweet. What do you say? Simply the best. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> OK, Leah Murray, who's that? My friend's wife. Your friend's wife yep. has sent a photograph of an aubergine. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> wait, 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 wait a 
minute. You're considering the aubergine. <laughs> it's my favourite vegetable. <laughs> so you, you were worried it was going to be a willy, <laughs> but you'd rather it was the emoticon symbol. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I didn't expect it, but <laughs> aubergine's in the mix, guys. <laughs> Am I right in saying that aubergine's in the leaf? Aubergine is in the mix. Aubergine, um, simply the best, and don't get another tattoo on my favourite so far. Underneath the tattoo you already have that says, don't get a tattoo. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll cross that one out. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! Ray? Oh, yeah, singer. Oh, yes, Ray's amazing. Goodness, this is a big ask. Mm. How about a picture of me? <laughs> or a microphone, because we both love to sing. Or some bread, because we both love bread. <laughs> <laughs> bread is the best. I would get a piece of bread. Bread's in the mix? Yeah. Yvonne's got quite involved. Oh, wow, yeah. Who's that? That's... <laughs> I don't even know how to explain who she is. She looks after me when I go to Ibiza. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take her number and move <laughs> on. <laughs> Anne-Marie loves peanut butter. So how about a peanut with a slogan underneath? I am a nutter, like peanut butter. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> I'm a nutter like peanut butter. That's not in the mix, is it? I might get a peanut butter jar. <laughs> OK, we have a short list. OK, go on. We have Aubergine from Leah Murray. We have Simply the Best from Grandad. Yeah. Everyone loves that one. That's a good one. <laughs> we have Michael McIntyre Forever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not getting much traction. <laughs> and we have Don't Get Another Tattoo from oh, Dad. Yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 a jar of peanut butter from Yvonne Anderson. Yeah. Yep. And bread. Bread. From Ray. I think you all like Simply the Best. Yeah! It's from your granddad. Yeah. And you Have know you... what's crazy? What? So that's from my dad's dad. Yes. And I don't think he even knows, but it was my mum's dad's favourite song. Oh. And he doesn't even know that. And he's, oh, and so he's... it feels good. Yeah, it's like perfect. And you're OK with this? Yeah. yeah Are you asking right. me or my mum? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was asking you. <laughs> yes. You're 100% yes. okay. Yeah, I will. I might get a piece of bread as well. Oh, the double! <laughs> <laughs> bread, not aubergine. Go bread, bread over aubergine. You can get the aubergine. Oh. <laughs> well, I know where I'll put it. <laughs> For me, it's a home from home. Uh, I know all the guys in here. I know all the guys in here. OK. Um, You're going to write it. Yeah, I, I've only just learnt that. So we're going to go bread, and I'm going to write simply the yes. best. And where are we putting it? Where... I'm going to put the simply the best on my leg. Amazing. And bread somewhere on my arm. OK, well, that sounds like a plan. Yeah, let's go. It's one of the most stressful things I've ever had to do in my life. Oh my god, this is going to be for the rest of your life. Yeah. I'm 
quite happy with the symphony. This is good. This is good so far. My bottom lip is sweating, but this is good. Yes! It looks really good. Yes! We're going to do it, okay? And here we go. <laughs> now the bread. <laughs> it looks really, really good. Is it cute? Yes, it, it absolutely really is. You've done an amazing job. Thank you. Well, I cannot believe you've done this. So here we have the two tattoos. We have. We have Simply, simply the, the Best. best. And a, and a slice, slice of, of bread. bread. Thank you very much <laughs> to Anne Marie. Give the audience a wave. What an incredible night. Sensational. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> oh my God. What an extraordinary set to all that was. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for the arrival of our unexpected star star of the show, Ricky Wilson from the Kaiser Chiefs. <laughs> So he's on his way to what he thinks is a soft play center for adults. So Ricky will have no idea that he's entering the theater because he'll be taken around the back of it, which looks like just a normal road with shops and offices. Then he is going to be high. Oh, by the way, it's the Kaiser Chiefs awaiting his arrival. They're all here. They're all in on it. <laughs> OK, so he's going to be crawling all over all sorts of padded rooms. He will then arrive at the top of the slide here and he will shoot onto this stage. You will go completely crazy. The band's going to strike up immediately and then hopefully he will sing the first line. Do you want to give me the intro and I'll, we'll see how that works before he arrives? Let's see. I've always wanted to do this. Tonight, as you said midway through the song. <laughs> so yeah, oh, you were Dick Dickinson or something. <laughs> um, yes, that, that was me earlier. First off, yes. Oh my God, what an insane, impromptu performance! What how was it that amazing? <laughs> I, I enjoyed it immensely. Thank you very much for that. Well, it, it must have been completely mind blowing for uh, you. To, um, so talk to me what went through your head. Because you were taking it very, very seriously, the soft play. You were really going for it. I just wanted to get over and done with. OK. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when I walked in, they said, this is for the radio, because, you know, I do the show. Yes. And then I said, has Chris Evans had to do this? And they went, no. <laughs> has Graham Norton done this? No. And I went, am I the first, then? And I was like, this... Uh, I Every time on the first one. <laughs> well, I'm we, stooge. we are all thrilled that Chris Evans wasn't singing for us tonight. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, we didn't know what was going to happen when, obviously, your band struck up that and, and how you're going to handle that. 
I mean, it, it was unbelievable. You sung that amazingly. Honestly, I can Thank sing you. that in a hurricane. Well, you certainly blew the roof off this place. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Ricky Wilson and the Kaiser Chiefs! <laughs> Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Good night, bravo! If you'd like to nominate someone for the unexpected star of the show or for any other surprise, go to bbc.co.uk slash big show for all the details.